There's two of you out here. Hey man, I you think you're actually making a difference? You're making people pissed off in this neighborhood. Dude, we didn't mean to do that. Go I home. You're the only Go person home. who's come out to complain. I live across the street. You're not the only one in this neighborhood. <laughs> Go home. No. There's two people standing out here on the corner of Timberline and Prospect, and they're having people honking. It's after 11 o'clock. I want them arrested right now. Right here in front of the police station on the corner. They're filming me, and I'm, I have to get up in three hours. They're having, they're standing, having, there's two people here holding a sign. They're having people honk as they're going by. I'm done with this. I'm done with it. Put me on the phone with the sergeant, please. Yeah, I, I will. You can record me all you want. I fought for this country. Put that on your goddamn video feed. I honestly don't care. You don't? Because I fought for your freedom. You fought for our First Amendment right, I right? did. And you know what? I have my First Amendment right. I'm saying go home. And I'm saying... Because you're keeping me up. Us. Every time somebody passes by here and honks, I live right across the street. You, you can come over to my house. I, I will feed you. I will clothe you. I will put you up for the night. But stop. Just Listen, stop. Dude. You're not fighting for anything. You know what? You want to fight for a right? Go to Minnesota and fight for it. I guarantee you you're going to wake up in a hospital bed there, hey, not here. Dude, 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 no, dude. seriously, go dude. the f home. Okay. Dude, I understand. Can we just ha can we just talk here, man? Uh, I'm, a I'm literally across the street from the freaking police station, and I got two people out here with a sign, and I got to get up in three hours. And I'm actually standing out here on the corner with these two people right here who are recording me right now. It is a male and a female. One's white, and I'm, I'm, I'm assuming, what, what's your nationality? Because you look La Hispanic. Latino. Latino, yes. White male, Hispanic female. I'm, I'm guessing under under 21. How old are you? I'm, I'm not going to answer questions. I'll wait. They're not going to answer questions. No, it's just these two people. No, but they don't understand. It's like my real faces, faces across the street from the police station, and there's, there's, I, I got to get up in three hours. And they want to argue with that because they're literally to protest it out here. I mean, if you guys want to go protest, go protest downtown where everybody else is at. I, I mean, I talk to you, dude, but if you come up down with us, it's kind of like a discussion. No, because even if I talk to you, are you still gonna leave? No, I would have. I would have listened to you, man. I would have loved to. Actually, I'm sorry. I would have loved to. All right, police are on their way. Right okay. okay. Perfect. They asked me to disengage, so. Okay. Thank Wonderful. you. Wonderful. But you guys can't do this. Basically, four cops ended us ended up surrounding my boyfriend and I. I wasn't able to get a video of the actual police conversation, but basically, this man pulled up. He came up to us and was like, "What's going on?" I tried to speak. He didn't listen to me. He didn't even look at me, and he was just looking at that man. And that man basically was like, "They're keeping me up. All this bullshit." Basically the same shit he's been um, saying the whole time. And my boyfriend and I were like, yeah, you know, and we apologize if we were keeping you up. But if you had come here and told us nicely that um, we were keeping up, we would have stopped. And basically he was lying to the cops saying that my boyfriend and I were twisting the whole story. When he left, he gave the cop a fist bump. The cop basically told us to leave because that man was right. Because even though we're protesting, it can be loud. It's never happened in Fort Collins though. We've had this protest going on for about four days and this is the first time the police have been called. I see a lot of people saying that my sign shouldn't have antagonized him and it shouldn't have said that people should honk. My sign never said to honk. People who drive by and honk, honk in support, but it's not because we asked them to.